Hello, you might know me as the John Brown Fort, but I was actually a fire engine house in Harpers Ferry, Virginia. Completed in June 1848, I was used as protection in case a fire broke out. Most days were about the same. Men and boys walked by every day on their way to work making guns. Trains passed through town several times a day. When night falls, the town grows quiet, except for the sound of the river. Then one day, everything changed. It was an October evening. My night watchman, Daniel, heard noises in town and went to the armory gate. Open gate! No. The citizens interfere. I must only burn the town and have blood. Here are some of the things I remember of that time. Around 4 a.m., raiders brought in hostages. Some were made to drill holes in my walls for guns. At 10 a.m., church bells started ringing, warning the citizens that something was wrong. Around 2 p.m., the mayor, Fontaine Beckham, was killed. There was so much chaos inside and out, John Brown was getting nervous and pacing around like an animal in a cage that day. 36 hours had passed since the commotion started. Men named Robert E. Lee and Jeb Stewart came to Harper's Ferry with Marines to put a stop to it. If they peaceably surrender, they shall be kept in safety to await the orders of the president. No! One, two, three. Eventually, the Civil War happens, and I was used as a prison, powder magazine, and a supply house. The Union soldiers loved me, but the Confederate troops did not. In Harper's Ferry, I became very famous. People loved me here. Later, I moved to Chicago for the World's Fair. I really didn't like it there. Hardly anyone came to visit. I was almost turned into a stable. Luckily, I was saved from that smelly place by a woman named Kate Field. She arranged for me to go back home to Harper's Ferry on Murphy Farm, where I lived from 1895 to 1909. Then I moved to Storer College and was used as a museum. Finally, in 1968, the National Park Service moved me back home to Lower Town. Today, I am one of the most important buildings in Harpers Ferry National Historical Park. Thousands of people visit me annually. Will you?